Well, right now, a strip mall shooting manhunt. WJCL's Brooke Butler live in Pooler, where it all went down. And Brooke, what can you tell us right now? Frank, right where I'm standing is where first responders rendered aid to that victim and moments later that put that victim on a stretcher. And just to give you some context, we are right off of Town Center Boulevard. Just behind us here is Pooler Parkway. But I want to show you a photo that we received earlier from a witness. They snapped a picture of the medics tending to the victim. Police tell me the actual shooting did not take place in the Air Force Reserve, though. They say it happened somewhere nearby. Police believe the victim and the shooter knew each other. They also mentioned there's no threat to the public. That being said, at this point, police still have not found and arrested the shooter. You can see a helicopter was looking for the suspect here. The shooting, though, has left some in this area uneasy. Very unusual. It's a pretty good neighborhood. It's scary. <laughs> we just want to get word that they have caught this person um, who's responsible for this and um, know that we're all safe here in this area again. Hey, Brooke, do we know the extent of the victim's injuries? Frank, I asked police. All they could tell me is that the victim is alive and has been taken to the hospital for treatment. But of course, we'll be sure to provide you with updates as we learn more. Back to you. All right, Brooke, thank you so much. Well, we're going to show you where police say this shooting happened earlier today. You can see it's the area near Audi Supermarket and Longhorn Steakhouse. We're going to continue to keep you updated on the search for the gunman, of course, on air and online at WJCL.com.